Hey everybody. As you know or may know, uh, a couple days ago I got my truck back uh, from my ranch for the first time since my amputation. Uh, and today I uh, modified the truck for hand controls. Uh, obviously with no right leg, I was driving using the left. Uh, and while it works, it's just not ideal. Um, a lot of what I do, uh, I, I drive a big super duty diesel truck and I tow a lot of trailers. Um, and I back into some very tight spots with very large uh, loads. And so um, it, it, I just wasn't getting the fine, fine control that I needed over the, the gas pedal. So I decided to go with hand controls. So I'm going to review two different sets of hand controls here, both of which came today and both of which I, I tested today. Uh, I go into the hospital tomorrow morning for surgery again. So it was great timing to get to get out and drive a little. So we're going to check out two different portable hand control systems. As you know, there's permanent hand controls, $1,500, $2,000, something like that. Most of them have quite a bit of complex linkage, a uh, lot of things that can get in the way of, of knees on existing legs. Uh, they do have some downfalls. Um, one of the benefits, of course, is that with permanent hand controls is that the traditional pedals can also be used by uh, other drivers. Um, whereas with these, there is some need to remove them for other drivers to use the, the vehicle. So the two that we're going to check out, um, both pretty cool. Uh, so this is the Pedal Master. Uh, and this is actually made by a company right here in Colorado, which is kind of cool. Uh, one of my family members was actually able to drive up there today and pick this up uh, from the owner's house. Uh, incredibly nice folks from, from what I'm made to understand. Um, and so this is the pedal master. And as you can see, there are two separate uh, devices, one for your brake and one for your gas. Um, and then the other device is called the quick stick. Um, and as you can see, this is still two different controls, one for your, your gas and one for the brake. Uh, however, these are combined into a form that keeps them together and allows for one-handed control. Your thumb is going to work the accelerator and your hand is simply going to push for the brake. So these are the two that we're going to check out. There's a couple other big differences that you'll notice. Um, with these, there is a trigger that simply opens the cloth at the end and allows you to place it around the pedal, let go, and, and off you go. Um, however, you do have two separate pieces to manage. With this one, you can see there are these aluminum clamps and these large wing nuts. And so this actually needs to be placed around the pedal, clamped down very, very tightly. Um, and so we'll also, I'll, I'll discuss some of the differences here between them um, as we get in the truck and, and check them out. Um, so again, these are the two that we're going to check out, the quick stick uh, and the pedal master. Um, both considered kind of the top two uh, available in the world for, for folks that are looking for uh, per, uh, temporary hand controls. Um, the other nice thing with these is that, of course, they can be used on rental cars or if you get a Turo vehicle while you're on vacation. Um, they can be used on things like garden tractors, golf carts, side-by-sides. Um, we do a lot of camping. We do a lot of hiking. Um, we love to off-road. We, we spend a lot of time on, on the side-by-sides, out on the mountain passes. Um, so things that are a big deal to me. So let's dig in. Let's check them out. Um, I was going to do this as two separate videos, but then decided to put them together as one because I think it, it makes sense. If you're looking for this type of product, well, let's compare the, the two top, uh, top contenders in the market. So let's go. Hey guys, today I received my first set of portable hand controls uh, for my Ford Super Duty uh, diesel. Um, pretty cool system actually, these are called Pedal Master. Uh, they're actually from a company right here in Colorado. Um, and so uh, a family member of mine was able to actually go up there and pick them up today. Um, I've also installed a steering ball on the wheel. Um, just because I'm not quite sure what it's going to be like using the hand controls here. Um, and I also, I, I, I tow a lot of trailers and so I'm often backing up in tight spots. And, um, so this is a pretty simple system overall. Uh, as you can see here, there's, there's two pieces, one that attaches to the brake, one that attaches to the gas. The connection is very, very secure. Um, 
as you can see here, this just has a quick release. Um, and so when you use the quick release, it opens the jaw and allows you to remove the device, put it on. And then I gave it kind of a twist. And I mean, she's on, it, it's not going anywhere. Um, same thing here with the, the gas. Um, again, very tight, very secure fit. Um, and I really like that they actually suspend in place. Uh, very, very convenient for me. And so it's nice to be able to um, apply, you know, I can even use just as little as a thumb here. Um, and same with the brake. Um, granted, it is easier to kind of really lay on it. A um, couple downfalls to this that a, that a, a permanent syst installed systems don't have. Most permanent systems give you a way to just kind of hit a hold button when you're at a stoplight. This you're going to have to actually physically hold. Um, but again, my initial uh, impression, very, very secure connection um, to the pedals here. Um, really, really impressed with that. So we're going to uh, take this one for a little spin and, and see what we think. Don't mind the fact that the truck uh, is a shithole. Uh, normally my vehicles are very, very clean, um, but needless to say, it hasn't exactly been at the top of the list lately. Um, so we're going to take a ride here, make sure everything is good. Uh, and let's see what we think of these pedal master hand controls that just arrived today. All right. Don't mind the beeping. I have a, uh, a trailer on the back for my scooter. Um, and so the reason it's beeping is because it thinks, uh, that I'm backing into something. Uh, I just didn't disable it. very very smooth here actually it gives me great control um, over the brake pedal okay my initial I mean we've gone 50 feet here um, but boy am I happy with this this is very very smooth very intuitive love that I get full range on the gas pedal here, uh, which is nice on this turbo diesel. Um, you know, when I want it, I want it. That's why I paid for it. Let's see here. Again, super smooth articulation here uh, using this as a brake. I'm, I'm very impressed with that. Uh, go ahead and go this way so we don't have to wait on traffic to turn. And then we'll Make a quick Louie here. Um, very easy moving back and forth. Um, you know, you do the same thing with your foot. So I don't really feel like I'm losing any reaction time or anything here. Um, the entire time that I've been filming this, I haven't even looked down at the controls really. Um, it's just pretty intuitive where they are. Um, again, really very tight fit here you can see I can even be pretty rough with it um, and it's okay boy is this much better than driving with the left foot um, as some of you know that's what I tried to start doing the other day really wasn't thrilled with it um, and then there's the fact that you know I may lose the, uh, the left leg soon anyway but anyway, getting back to the Pedal Master Pro, or I'm sorry, the, the Pedal Master. I don't know where the hell I got Pro from. Um, this thing is actually great. Like I said, very secure here on the pedals. Um, just a really nice feel to it. Uh, they're super lightweight. Um, really working out for me. This was with no adjustment. Uh, this was out of the box and they were set up within 20 seconds. pedal there. My neighbors are going to love me for hauling ass through here like a teenage idiot, but what are you going to do? Boys will be boys, right? Uh, so again, uh, pretty impressed with this. Um, this is very nice finesse here. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this ball or not um, on the steering wheel. I don't know that it's necessary. Again, I think it could 
come in handy for certain things though. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and bust a Yui here. full use of the gas pedal which uh, on the super duty here is nice you know it's a turbo diesel you want to you want to be able to really get on it when you want to get on it all right so I guess that's the the quick review of the pedal master uh, out of Colorado uh, American made um, the gentleman who created it and sells it wicked wicked nice fella uh, my family was up there today to pick this up um, again incredibly tight feel here very very secure um, I, I would drive cross country like this uh, tomorrow without any hesitations at all um, so I guess if you're looking for a portable um, hands uh, driving system um, the pedal master is definitely a good way to go uh, I highly recommend it. I'll let you know what I think after maybe a, a week or so more of, of using it. Um, but in brief, I can't see what would uh, what would change about the user experience here. It's quite pleasant. So that's the Pedal Master. Thanks a lot to you guys uh, right here in Colorado. It was awesome to not only be able to get something uh, that accommodates my need, but be able to do it uh, semi-locally here uh, in our fantastic state with my fantastic neighbors. So, Pedal Master, highly recommend, definitely a 10 out of 10. Uh, nice, secure, lots of finesse. Those aren't going anywhere. So I'm also going to do a review on another system called the Quick Stick. Um, which does uh, um, uh, assemble a little bit differently and install the vehicle a little bit differently. Um, so keep an eye out for that one. We'll do that one. I have uh, surgery tomorrow on the left leg, so wish me luck. Um, and we'll do a, a review on that one uh, uh, when I get back home. So thanks, guys. Have a good one. All right, everybody, back with you to check out a second uh, hand control system, a second uh a portable hand control system. As you know, the last time we checked out the uh, Pedal Master, um, this time we are checking out the Quick Stick. Um, and this is another portable hand control. Uh, however, this one actually clamps to the pedals. Um, so a bit more of a semi-permanent install than with the, the Pedal Master. Um, the Pedal Master, you simply pull the trigger, clamp it to the pedal and go. Um, this actually has uh, uh, two aluminum clamps with large wing nuts that need to be tightened down, um, which means that if somebody else wants to drive the vehicle, they're going to have to be removed for them to use the standard pedals. Um, so right away, that is one downfall of the quick stick uh, compared to uh, the pedal master. Um, on initial uh, installation here, it was quick and easy. I had it installed in less than 60 seconds. Um, full control of the brake here. Um, apparent full control of the uh, gas um, and so again I do still have the the uh, uh, ball on the wheel here just for a little bit of additional I think I'm actually gonna remove it don't really think I need it um, and so we're gonna give this quick stick a try um, and compare it to the pedal master so let's get out of here Again, it's beeping because I have a, a trailer thing on the back so it, uh, for my scooter, so it thinks I'm going to back into something. But First thing I notice here is that pretty good control uh, of the brake. Boy, that's annoying. Sorry, friends. Shit. Uh, so let's see here. Again, uh, you know, initial uh, thing is... Okay, pretty pretty good here. I can really get her to lock when I want to. Um, you know, it's only been a couple seconds here, but I will say um, this is nice by comparison in that, uh, damn, it feels good just having things in one hand. Um, 
also just I guess my particular vehicle type here I can very comfortably rest my arm on the uh, um, center console here um, which is nice let's see how um, she does on the rest of this uh, again you know these portable ones are nice because if you're uh, if you're vacationing or traveling on business and you're say renting a car um, you know you need uh, you need some options um, again let's see here oh yeah so with very easy adjustment um, I definitely have full control over the throttle here and I definitely have full control over the brake pedal um, which is very nice uh, nothing seems to be binding or catching um, which again just from a safety standpoint So yeah, this is definitely different. One of the things I was concerned about with the quick stick was that the thumb might take an awful lot of pressure. Um, but it, it really doesn't seem to. The way that it uh, it applies to the, the way that it clamps to the, the throttle pedal um, really just gives you some good leverage. Uh, so there's, there's just great torque with very little effort there. Um, this one feels a little different than the pedal master the pedal master is a little stiffer you don't hear this rattle that you can hear in this product um, but i do believe there's something to be said for this two-in-one design um, i'm really enjoying this i am really liking not having to move my hand um, to go from one to the other um, Yeah, boy, that's nice. It's, uh, let's see how. Again, it's just really nice to not have to uh, take the product out of my hand at all. Um, you know, the other one, it wasn't really a big deal, um, but there is that little bit of time in between um, where this just does not have that. Um, I'm in a very large truck in a very, very tight space here right now, and piece of cake. Um, not bothering me in the least bit. I have very good articulated control over the throttle, uh, as well as the brake. You'll notice here I'm not jumping in all over the place. Uh, I can pull pretty firmly, and the product doesn't go anywhere. Uh, the clamps do secure very securely to the, the brake and gas pedal, um, and boy, I don't know. I am really liking this one hand control. Um, have to say, I'm a big fan of the uh, Pedal Master because of the uh, people behind it. Uh, again, local, great folks. Um, but hot damn, I gotta say, um, this is really nice, this one handed control. Uh, again, one of the, the downfalls of this is the way that this installs. Um, does require a somewhat semi-permanent install and so uh, if somebody else were to drive my truck they're going to have to take this off to use the standard pedals um, again in the the pedal master uh, very simple pull the trigger it expands place it over the pedal let go of the trigger though i will say um, i literally installed this product the the quick stick here um, in less than two minutes um, and that was from the time that I opened the box until the time I started this video. Um, so, and this is kind of nice. You can see it, it sits without a problem. Um, but wow, is there something nice about this one-handed control. Um, between that and the ball here, um, it's actually a remarkably pleasant driving experience. This truck also happens to have autonomous crews, um, which is really nice, you know, so you just set that and forget it. And, uh, it's got lane assist, it's damn near autonomous driving. Um, and so this is, uh, hey Dan, beep beep. Uh, so this is, this is really nice. Um, like I said, I, I love the folks behind the Pedal Master, um, but wow, this, uh, this control with one hand like this without having to, to switch from one stick to the other. Um, whew, very, very nice. Uh, so that's what I think of the quick stick. Um, there you go. Um, 
both great products. Uh, if you didn't see the uh, the video for the other one, I'm going to put these both together just into one video. It'll be a little bit longer, but at least then um, folks can kind of see the, the two at the same time. Um, have to say, um, the, the Pedal Master uh, does secure a little more firmly. Again, as you can hear, there's some rattle in here. Um, with the Pedal Master, you don't get that. They're very, very solid on the pedal. You don't have these aluminum shafts uh, secured by a, a pin and a cotter with the extra play in it. So they're quieter um, and they're definitely, they feel a little harder. Uh, they feel a little more permanent to the pedal. Um, however, that said, the quick stick just performed very, very well on its first try. Um, I do believe I'm gonna leave the quick stick on for now um, and we'll go from there. Um, but anyway, there's the difference between the Pedal Master uh, and the Quick Stick. Both awesome options. I will say the Quick Stick was available on Amazon for about 150 bucks, uh, whereas the uh, uh, the Pedal Master was about $330, and uh, that was with a discount because we didn't have them ship it. We went and picked it up. Um, so definitely a vast price difference. Um, so let me know what you think. If you have any questions about them, feel free to ask. Uh, God knows I'm full of opinions for fuck's sake. Um, and so we'll move on from there. But either way you go, uh, Pedal Master Quick Stick, if it gets you out, if it gives you some freedom back, if it gives you some mobility back, it's a win, friends. Talk to you soon.